What's going on guys, Alan or Alien26 full here back with another tutorial. So I just thought I'd make this to help those of you who are having the same problem as me. So basically it's the matchmaking server bullshit fix like you see on the screen right now. There are two methods to solve this problem. And the first method I'm about to show you was recorded like a month ago and I thought I was gonna make a video like that, but there's actually another way to help this out. So I suggest you try the first method and then after try the second one if the problem keeps continuing. So here's the first method. Okay, so all the shit in the background is blurred because it's top secret information, but you wanna go down here in the bottom left start and then go to control panel and now go to system and security and now just search up advanced system settings and now click the settings go to data execution prevention and when you first get your computer it should have the top one selected but just make sure you select the one right under it and click OK or apply and you'll have to restart your computer after this is done and when you open up CSGO again, it should work. Okay guys, so if you try that and it keeps on fucking up, here's what you gotta do. Make sure Steam is closed and CSGO is closed. And then click Control Alt Delete. And then go to Task Manager. So it should look like this, as you can see, Steam or CSGO isn't open. Click More Details. And then you can see like all the other programs that are like running in the background. So what you should do is go down on Background Processes and get rid of Steam. So end task, end task, operation, fuck off. But basically, I ended those Steam tasks that were running. Let's just check one more time. Okay, it's good. Now you can just X out task manager. And now open up Steam again. So basically, Steam is just going to restart. Now go to games, view games library. I only have Counter-Strike because I'm poor, and that's the only game I'm good at. Go right here, right click, go to properties. Now go to local files and now click verify integrity of game cache. And as you can see, it'll begin to load. This can take really short or really fast depending on like how often you do this or how often you restart Steam in general. So this will fix your problem temporarily. And if it does happen again that your matchmaking or VAC fucks up, just repeat this step again and it should work. Otherwise, it has to do with your internet connection or something like that. Personally, I think it's because I have two mega PCs running in my house. And yeah, so this should solve the problem. So if this video did help you out, guys, don't forget to drop a like and comment down below. Also, subscribe to stay tuned for my other content. Thank you for watching. Peace out.